are at the special appointment Stepney Bank Stables on the 6th of August in the afternoon. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a very real privilege for me to be here with you today as Her Majesty's personal representative in time and Weir to present on her behalf the Queen's Golden Jubilee Award for your truly outstanding work within this community. of The Queen's intention in introducing this new prestigious annual Golden Jubilee Award is to give well-deserved recognition to some of the heroes within our community who play a really essential role in our daily lives. The award is made to groups such as your own who reach out and touch the lives of those within the community from all walks of life and in doing so help bring confidence to individuals within the community, some of whom have felt that they had very little hope of further achievement. But you allow all of your volunteers to develop a wide range of skills, and you do this through the use of the horse as your tool to educate, to motivate, and then to pass on social skills. You have provided a wide range of activities with the emphasis, I'm pleased to see, being on fun, on healthy pursuits, and on variety. And you've created what I hear is a very special atmosphere where young and old volunteers from the inner city, some with disabilities, can work alongside other adults to form a team, enjoy a mutual interest which in turn enables you easily to integrate all newcomers and help them participate within your project. We owe all of you an enormous debt of gratitude for your successful enterprise and I'm also delighted that your work has been recognised. Do your activities help to develop the individual but it boosts the self-esteem of local communities and helps, ultimately, to enrich the life of our nation. You have demonstrated a proven record of accomplishment and of active community involvement since your earliest days. This unique organization started with very humble beginnings as part of the Biker Farm, and now, as a separate organisation, you have established respect and recognition throughout the area by involving a large number of people. And a good example of this was your Gymkhana, which brought together all manner of competitors with a great variety, I'm told, of skills and abilities or in some cases, I gather, inabilities, who laughed and cheered with great enthusiasm, so giving confidence to the other competitors, as well as enjoyment to those who were present. Now, the project itself receives no core funding, although the judges noted that this project had been very much helped by the support through Sport England, who provided this absolutely magnificent arena. However, you have undertaken your own fundraising, and I was very impressed to learn that the volunteers raised two and a half thousand pounds at the annual street, uh, Christmas Street Collection, and more recently raised all the necessary funds for this year's holiday in the Peak District, which for some of you, I gather, sadly means no riding for a week. And I don't know how you'll cope. Anyway, I know that subsequently you'll be taking your horses away along to the summer camp with you. 
So Jeremy Beecham, who you will remember was the deputy lieutenant who visited you, and I have been greatly uh, impressed by all your achievements because your project brings together representatives from a variety of backgrounds and ages and offers interest and support in so many different ways. So Jeremy has told me that he was most interested and impressed with your initiative and that you were a very dedicated group of people and how worthy you would be to receive some form of recognition. His thoughts and my thoughts went on to the judges and you now know what they decided. And of course, your success has not come on notice by the media. And again, I think you attracted uh, national as well as local attention. And we all look forward to receiving and seeing the results of the recent CBBC recordings. And I understand that taking place perhaps even now. I see someone in the background. Finally, the judges themselves were particularly impressed that you have generated a very high level of local goodwill and respect through your ability to combine horse riding with stable work and educational programs. You look after your horses, I'm told, with great care and affection. And that many of you, I'm pleased to hear, are progressing onto nationally recognized equestrian qualification. This is a truly imaginative project. It is well supported by a core of dedicated full-time staff who are equally well supported by so many of you, the volunteers. All of you have shown dedication and immense commitment towards Stephanie Bank Stables, and I know are participating in seeing how you can develop your ideas and your initiative in the future. It's therefore with enormous pleasure that I present to you on behalf of Her Majesty, Her Majesty the Queen's Golden Jubilee Award and Certificate to Julian Martin, who will receive it on your behalf. the certificate which has the citation. Well, thank you. I am very proud uh, to accept this prestigious award on behalf of all the volunteers here at Stepney. Um, horse riding is often uh, thought to be the preserve of the wealthy or an elitist activity. But this project exists to make sure that it is something that's accessible to all in the community, regardless of their income, where they live, or the abilities they have. It can only do this because of the dedication of our wonderful staff and the large number of volunteers that we have who give their time to ensure that others can enjoy riding and take part in the educational and other benefits that are offered here. Um, thanks to the commitment of the staff, there is also the opportunity for the young and not so young volunteers to learn more about horse care and everything else that goes on here, making volunteering more rewarding. And most importantly of all, this is a fun place to be, which is more popular than ever. This means the work of the volunteers is more important than ever. It is therefore extremely gratifying to have our efforts recognised in this way. So thank you once again.
Would you like to have a uh, look around? Nice? That's a good speech. Well done, Julie. You don't know me, my name is Phil McLaughlin. Well, okay. Turn it up a little bit more straight. That's it, yeah. It's good. Lovely. Oh, so that was lovely. So. It's a really good speech, Julie. Yeah, it was a good, yeah. It's gone. Um, Yeah, that was a lovely ceremony, wasn't it, Susan? Yes, I'll yeah. we'll run again. By the grace of God of the United Kingdom, Great Britain and Northern Ireland, and all our other realms and territories, Queen Defender of the Faith, to Stepney Bank Stables, educating and motivating young people from inner city areas and adults with learning difficulties. Greetings. We, being cognizant of the said group's outstanding voluntary work in the community and being desirous of showing our royal favour, do hereby confer upon it the Queen's Golden Jubilee Award for Voluntary Services by Groups in the Community 2003. For such period, as the group continues to provide its current service and do hereby give permission for the authorised emblem of the said award to be displayed on the group's letterhead and other public material. Given that our court of St James under our royal sign met this the second day of June 2003 in the 52nd year of our reign. Thanks very much indeed, Julian. That's it's a wonderful acclaim, that, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And your speech was good too. Lovely ceremony. Good speech and no rain today. It was marvellous. Did you enjoy it, yeah? Oh, yeah? What's your connection with here then? You get? My daughter comes in. Oh, great. She helps out on a Sunday all day. Terrific. It's part of the BBC. Oh, lovely, yeah. It's all nice. Yeah. Well, what, what, what's her name? What's your daughter's name? Zoe. Zoe James. Oh, Zoe, yeah. Thanks very much. What, what, oh, what is your name? Sheila. Sheila. Oh, Sheila. Lovely. Thank 